So Charlemagne and Andrew Schultz have the Brady Idiots podcast. They've been having it for years. I'm a huge fan. And recently they were speaking about Umar Johnson being the boogeyman for interracial relationships. And Charlemagne said, man, I agree in regards to far as shaming people or looking at people funny who speak black, talk black, real, real big, but then they outside their race. Check this out right here. Something is there. So uh, people, you acting like you gotta convince you don't gotta convince me, bro. People, I know it's there. People be hating on Dr. Omar, man. No, they're stupid. Work they don't have a sense of humor. They don't have a sense of humor. They don't have a sense of like th- it's no question that he's the funniest guy on the internet, right? There's to no question. me because he's not trying. And I love the fact that he's become the boogeyman of biracial relationships. Yo, d- <laughs> if, if you pop up with a biracial relationship, Dr. Umar is watching you. That's bro. the only thing I disagree with that he says. What? About biracial relationships. What, what you you should that? be able to love whoever you love. That being said, Dr. Umar, not me. You can, <laughs> you, know <what> I'm saying? <laughs> you can love whoever you want to love, but I'm judging. Are you judging? I'm only Who ju- are you to judge? A black man with a black woman. <laughs> well, I guess that makes sense. I guess that seems to have a lot of sense only behind reason, it. All, only reason I'm judging it is because, like, you know, if you're one of those people that talk so pro-black, you know what I mean? Ah. But you sleep white on either side, male or female, I'm like, yeah. okay, come on. Come on. Now, what come if on. you're one of those people who talk so pro-white? But got a black woman. But got a black woman. What do you say about that? Pro-white as fuck, black woman. I think I respect it. I never thought about it. Right? Yeah, I never thought about it. Wouldn't that be kind of fun? You mean a black man? What do you mean a black man with a black white woman? dude? Oh no, no, no. I don't know. No. Maga in the streets. Nope. Nope. <laughs> Something nope. else in the nope. streets. Nope. <laughs> Maga in the streets. N W A C P. <laughs> no man, I want. I like black N W A. How do you say that by shit? The way, bro? What's wrong, by the way, what's wrong with saying that? Saying what? Black men should be with black women. And listen, I, Asians like to keep it in their community, right? That's Chris? not true. Jewish men have been dating Asians. For I bet centuries. you. I bet you. Some people on our, your wife's side had a little problem with it, right? No, they're incredibly happy. They didn't at all. They love that. It's an accomplishment. They what? Oh, Jewish okay, man, okay, 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 okay. Asian woman. Match made in heaven. Some Chinese people don't like the. They don't like the uh, people marrying black people. Well, that is different. Different story. It's a, it's a different Chris story. It's a different story. There's a different. <laughs> that's a very different story. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Yeah yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. That that is what we would call racism. Is what you're. <laughs> that is what. It, that's that's racist. Is you know it? I mean? Are they preference? Is what? it? Is it community? Yeah, well, sometimes. Yeah, I don't. I don't know. I don't know if it's racist or they just want to keep it in the community. I don't know. Well, they're they're fine not keeping the community when it's a Jewish guy. Blasian is big now. Ooh, black. Chris said Blasian with is big Asian now. girl. Black male Asian girl. My kids, you're either Asian. White you Asian. White Chris. Was, well, well, I yeah. never heard what Chris just said. Asian. Chris said, "I thought that was a fucking GPS app." Asian. <laughs> That's not the, oh, not the, there you go, Chris. Chris who cares about a mask? mask? Oh, no, baby. So it used to be any half Asian kid in America was known as Hopper. Hopper. Right? Really? Which That's is, a West Coast thing. East Coast, West, we never West said Hawaiian, that. Hawaiian, actually. Yeah, yeah, but it, yeah. That was supposed to be the official term. What yeah. does Hopper mean? I, I think it's a Hawaiian term for mixed. Okay, okay. okay. So okay. you could be half black, half Asian, half Jewish, half Asian, whatever. Yeah. According to my kids, the in New York City at least, it's Blasian. Which is black and Asian, mm-hmm. or Wasian, which is white and Asian. Wow! Yeah. And they they re- oh yeah she's Wasian or oh, that other oh there are a lot of Wasian kids in this class yeah a lot of Blasian kids in this class but I think the ki- I mean like we always like Whitney Houston always said the children are the future right so I think the yeah. kids are way more progressive than the generations before them were so they probably won't even look at it as oh it's a problem to be with a black person or it's a problem to be with a white person it's the old it's us older folks that's that's saying keep up. it. Keep it pure. Have you heard what fuck? Dr. Umar has said about the half white, half Asian? No. He calls them snow dragons. <laughs> and, uh, <laughs> and, it's, 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 <laughs> and that, is listen, it, Dr. Umar is, is the funniest yo, guy. That's going to melt that's, all the stuff. <laughs> yo, I'm telling y'all right now. That's not going nowhere. Snow dragons is snow going to fire. <laughs> <laughs> snow dragons is going to stick. Yeah, listen. <laughs> No <laughs> dragons is crazy, though. Very interesting clip right there, man. I can't lie. I understand that sentiment and I agree. Or I just prefer my sisters, you feel me? I prefer my ladies. I prefer dealing with my people. That's a real concern of mine. 
and it may not be the next person and i get that but you can't conflate things by speaking that you are fighting or living for these things but you're not moving that way as far as like the way you date the way you sleep the way you live the kids that you're going to bring into this world those things do matter when it comes to the whole grand scheme of teens but let me know what you guys think in the comment section below brothers that do want to do that i get that live your life but when it comes to speaking on certain topics your word doesn't hold the same weight you are fighting a different battle right now you are on the individual journey as far as greatness and that's cool that's your thing do it it's your boy stacy i'm out Godspeed merch collection is out right now featuring this basic tee right here as well as the premium tee the oversized premium tee you feel me yes sir hey man make sure y'all go ahead and get it right